All right, Kim, so lawyers at the Texas Right, for Life, or right to Life at your organization are representing Tinsley and uh, her family here. You got the date extended to December 10th, correct? That is correct. We're very grateful for this extension. Now, keep in mind, the hospital wanted to pull the plug on Tinsley on November 10th. Now we have this extension to December 10th. That is a whole extra month of life for this little baby girl that would have been cut short under the Texas 10-day rule had we not intervened. Right. It's, it's, it's incredible to watch this unfold. So now, between now and November or December 10th, it is your goal to find a facility that will take, uh, that will take Tinsley in, right? Absolutely. Texas Right to Life's patient advocacy team is working around the clock to find a new facility anywhere in the country to uh, take in Tinsley Lewis. Now, we're so grateful for everybody who stepped up praying for Tinsley, emailing us leads for new hospitals. This has been such a blessing. And now that we have more time, uh, there is more hope for Tinsley Lewis. So we are very grateful for that. And what's the response been from other hospitals around the country, other facilities you've reached out to? Uh, we're still uh, navigating these facilities. We're still looking out uh, to find some more. So it's just been a process. And now keep in mind, the transfer process for any patient can be long and laborious. Now, whenever you place an arbitrary countdown on this process, you're making it almost impossible for everyday Texans. You have to navigate legal, financial, and medical hurdles to uh, make a transfer while caring for a loved one in a Texas hospital. Under the 10-day rule, whenever you have this countdown, it is a death sentence for Texas patients. It's in hundreds of Texans, by the way, it's not just baby Tinsley have been subjected to this. What's the response been? So when we talked to you, I believe it was early last week, we talked about the Texas legislature and Governor Greg Abbott. They have the ability to call a special session in the state capitol and repeal this rule. We called for them to do it. I know your organization has. What's been the response from Texas Republicans? A few Texas Republicans have stepped up and uh, supported us in changing this law. We're very grateful for them. Uh, I have not heard anything from Greg Abbott's office. We do pray that he will call a special session. He is the only one who has the power to end this right now. He has to call a special session to end the 10-day rule. Last time we talked, Liz, I said that I hoped Tinsley would be the last patient to deal with this. And tragically, I was wrong. Since Tinsley's case has been in the media, we've gotten more calls to our office saying this is happening to them right now. This is a euthanasia epidemic. And Governor Greg Abbott should call a special session to end it.